Today we'll be going over the first video in section 3, creating clean web and REST services, an introduction to Iron Router. We'll take a look at Iron Router, why it's needed, and resources available for Iron Router to learn more about it, and then we'll install it for our application. When developing web applications, you want to be able to control flow. Okay, where the user is at, what the user is looking at, and whether they're looking at multiple records, say, or a in single individual record, or maybe even if they're updating something. The way to do that traditionally is through a routing package to control the page that they're on or the state that the application is in. Chris Mathers put together an excellent package called Iron Router. And this package is available in Atmosphere, and it has well over 43,000 downloads and 218 stars, by far the most popular package out there, and for good reason. It's well documented, it's constantly updated, and it's put together by someone who really knows what Meteor is all about. In the overview, you'll be able to see different resources that are available, including and especially the Iron Router Guide that Chris has made available here. This will take you through a quick start to get up and running very, very quickly. And we'll cover in the table of contents all the different concepts of server and client side, the routing parameters, the layouts, how it interacts specifically with Blaze, and everything that you need to know in order to get up and running very, very quickly. There's also an available video series on eventedmind.com. Okay. Include an introduction video to see if it's right for you, and if so, there's a subscription in order to view the rest of the content. But if that's the way you learn, that's a fantastic resource available to you. We're now ready to install Meteor for the application we created in Section 2. Okay, So head over to a terminal window and enter the command Meteor add iron colon router. That's all it takes to download all of the necessary packages, the core package, the controller, everything that is needed in order to run inside of our application. And even though we haven't configured any routes yet, we can see that it's available and it's properly installed. If we go back to our homepage, you can see there it is, Iron Router, organize your Meteor application with a sample of how to use it. If we scroll down, you can see the GitHub repo that's available, as well as the guide that we referred to earlier. So that's your introduction to Iron Router. Some guides that are available, documentation, and we have installed it for our application as well. In our next video, using Iron Router templates, we'll specifically go over configuration of those templates inside of our application. Thanks, and we'll see you then.